According to the Metro National Police Department, the shooter had three weapons with them at the time of the shooting, two semi-automatic rifles. They do appear to be obtained legally. They also had a handgun. And then at their home, police later found two sawed-off shotguns and another weapon. But, you know, it's just not difficult at all in Tennessee to get any type of weapon. Over the last six or seven years, we've seen the legislature increasingly passing laws that even law enforcement officials and law enforcement organizations oppose. It's bizarre to me that there are so many lawmakers here who can only talk about the Second Amendment. I bet they couldn't even name what goes on in many of the other amendments, but this is the one they are focused on.